you let me, I would like to ask one question to the ministers. Which ones? All the ministers. You have a question for all of them and you want them all to reply. They just so I need, need to go to home and a get a answer. change of clothes. They just need to give me a thumbs up. Ah, that's a good one. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Thank you. Especially the ministers from the global north. Do you think that the people who are least responsible for the climate crisis and the ones who are suffering some of the worst impacts of this crisis deserve our help? Thumbs up. Higher up. So all of you believe that the people who are suffering right now deserve our help. So I'll ask a second question. Will your countries commit to putting money and finding loss and damage for those countries at COP27? <laughs> now that's where the problem is. My first question is like your statements. You're promising us. You're talking about what you're going to do. And my second question is about real action. Loss and damage is happening right now. We can't adapt to the loss of our cultures, the loss of our identities, the loss of our histories. We can't adapt to extinction or to starvation. We cannot adapt to loss and damage. So the first question equals to your statements, promises, pledges, sweet nothings. And the second question is about action. But everyone saw how the ministers were hesitant to say that their countries will commit to funding loss and damage at COP27 in Egypt. Thank you. So let me just...